Nice garden, Uncle Sam. Thanks, Susie. Hey, Deborah, I'll take one apple cider. Good morning, Susie. It's on the house. Thank you. What do you want? Oh, I'll take a pickle and a lemon. Interesting combo. But okay. Pickle and lemon. Put in here. Scrub the bottle. There you go. Enjoy. Thank you. Oh, hey, Mark. <clears throat> hey. Nice seeing you here. Yeah. Well, I gotta go. Bye. Cindy, where are you? I'm right here, bestie. Hey, Cindy. Hey, girl. Don't you just love our country life? I just love living in the country. It's the best thing ever. I know, right? I see you got some apple cider there. You want to try some? Of course I do. You know me. Apple cider Cindy. Yep. Oops, I drank it all, I guess. It was so good. Ah, uh, it's okay. I'll see you later, Cindy. I gotta go back home now. Bye. Bye. Hey. Oh, do you want an apple? Here you go. No. Hey. I don't have another one. No. Hey. Ah! No. Hey. hey, Stacy, Lenny, and Egg. Oh, and hey, General. <gasps> Did you get some eggs for us? I'll collect those. I'll see y'all later. Steven, Dave, what are y'all doing here? We're collecting apples. Yeah, we need some for our grandma's apple pie. Well, take as many as you like. We have plenty of apple trees here. Great. Can we also get some cherries, too? Of course. Help yourselves, boys. Yes! Wait, I feel like I'm about to fall. No! I got you! That was a close one. Did you get any apples at all? Uh, are you kidding me? Okay, okay, I'm going back up. I got one. I can't wait for... Did you just eat the apple? I was hungry. Come on, focus. I'm ready to eat Maymall's famous apple pie. Okay, fine. There you go. This apple looks so good. Don't eat it. Uh. <gasps> that was amazing. Uh. Uh, you did it too. Well, whatever. Granny Sally, I'm back. Oh, hello, dear. Welcome back. I brought some eggs from the hen. That's great, honey. I'll put these in the kitchen, the fridge, you know. Oh, I'll do that for you, Granny. It's okay. Are you sure? Yes, of course I'm sure. Oh, Granny, what are you cooking? Oh, you know, just some chicken and steak. Sounds delicious. Your mother should be back soon, darling. I'll go to my room in the meantime. Okay. Oh, Whiskers and Snowdrop. Have you guys had a wonderful day today? Hip, hip. Well, I can't wait for my mama to get home. Oh, I think she's here now. Bye, guys. Hey, y'all, I'm home. Oh, weren't you just a bundle of joy today? Of course, mama. I got you this hat. Oh, my word, that looks expensive. How did you afford this? I'll tell you when uh, Susie gets in here. Well, thank you so much. It is beautiful. No problem. Mom. Hey, dearie. I got you a gift. Oh, really? What is it? I didn't think we could afford anything now. Well, actually, I found a way to make more money. <gasps> That's amazing, Mom. Here's your gift. <laughs> you, you got me a banjo? Mom, I've wanted a banjo since, like, forever, since I was eight. I know, dearie. That's why I got it for you. How did you get the money to afford a banjo? And a non-used one, too. Well, I may or may not have signed you up for something. Signed me up for what? There is a journaling company in a really big city. What city? News City. Only the, the, only the biggest city in the whole world? Wait, 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 how does this make you money? Well, they had an experiment where they wanted to take an 18-year-old from um, a really small country and assign them to an apartment and someone to help them around the city um, just to see how that experiment goes and how they act and stuff. They basically want to see if they can transform a country girl into a city girl. Okay. 
and I signed you up, and I got it. You, you're going to, to New City. What? 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 Who's going to rub my feet? Ew, Granny, I wasn't going to do that anyway. I had dreams, okay? Mom, I'm a country girl, not a city girl. I don't belong in the city. Yeah, she belongs here with me, our granny. Listen, honey, we would have had to sell the house. Our pie business is not doing good. And I lost my job the other day. I know, but I still wanted... I, what? I can't go to the city. Listen, you only have to go for two months. Then you can come back. If you even want to come back then, because their goal is to make you want to stay there. I don't want to. I don't want to be be forced to stay in the city. It's for two months, okay? <sighs> Fine, Mom. Great. When do I leave? Oh, yeah, I probably should have told you. You leave tomorrow. Tomorrow? I have to go pack my bag. Yeah, sorry about that, hun. Okay, I'm going to go pack my bag. Oh, I can't forget my banjo. Oh. Well, time to pack my bags, because I leave tomorrow, I guess. Let's see. What do I have in my closet? Of course, my favorite country sweatshirt. And my favorite square dancing dress. I wonder if they square dance in the city. Never mind. My favorite country singer. Of course, my banjo. How could I forget? I've wanted a play since I was, like, five or six. My favorite teddy bear. I've had it since I was two. Oh, I wish I could take you bunnies, but I can't. <gasps> but of course, I have to take a book of all my favorite horses. Oh, don't be sad, Whiskers. I'll come back. Don't worry. I don't think I'll ever be a city girl. But I'll sure try for my family. Well, all my bags are packed. <sighs> oh, I better send a letter to Sydney saying that I'm, I'm going. Uh, where's the, where's the notes? Here, I'll write it on this piece of paper, and I'll go send it to her. <gasps> me, 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 Nom, nom, nom. Ugh, what was that next sound? Did you eat my fish? No. <laughs> uh, never mind. Knock, knock, knock. What's that knock at the door? Here, Sandy, I got a letter for you. Bye. Oh, that was random. Whatever. I'm leaving to go to New City tomorrow for two months. I need you to take care of the pie shop. No, my best friend's leaving me. <laughs> Ooh, but I get to take over the pie shop. Wait, I don't even know how to bake a pie. Oh, whatever. I'll find it out tomorrow. I'm tired. Good night, pony. Nee. Well, now she knows. I should go to bed now. The next day. Well, bye, guys. I best get going if I want to make it to the big city. I'm gonna miss you so much. Please don't leave. I'm sorry, Cindy, but I gotta go. <laughs> I know, but I wish you could stay longer. Here, take some milk for the road. Yeah, and an apple. Thanks. And a bee. Zzz. Ah, uh, uh, no, thank you. Zzz. I'll miss you, honey. Good luck. Thank you, Mom. I'm doing this for us. I'm doing this for Dad. Go get him, honey. Come back soon so you can rub my feet. Again, Grandma, that's never gonna happen. Okay. Bye, y'all. Let's put this in the back and drink this milk. Okay, I'm ready now. Bye, everybody. Bye. I'll see you later in two months. There is no way I'm gonna become a city girl. After the long trip. Well, uh, the person I'm supposed to be meeting told me to meet her at this, like, kind of grand station place. So, I'm gonna go in there. Well, I'm here. Whoa, this is a lot of people. Uh, move out the way, weirdo. Uh, the nerve. Hey. Hey, yeah, you. Me? No, not you, the person I'm calling. Yeah, you. No, not you. Okay, just let me explain this. Uh, what just happened? Okay, where am I supposed to be going? Hey, you. Huh? Me? Yeah. Uh, hey. 
Are you talking to me or the thing in your ear this time? What are you talking about? I'm not talking to anything in my ear. Oh, somebody had headphones and they were talking to their buddy. Not you. Huh? Anyway. Anyway, my name is Jessica. Nice to meet you, Jessica. I'm Susie. Did you have a nice ride over here? Of course I did. Okay, well come this way because we need a before and after photo of you. A before and after photo. Right this way. Whoa, this looks nothing. Like, this looks crazy. This looks like nothing like what we would have in my old town. Well, I think the city is more advanced than your small town. Probably, because this, this is crazy. Okay, now, uh, I'm just going to take a picture of you, so... Okay, then. Oh, it looks amazing. Let me see. It looks so good. How does that work? Um, it's a bunch of technology. Anyway, I'll show you back to our apartment. Apartment? You don't have a house? Well, there's not a lot of room for houses in the city because there's so many people that live in the city. I can tell. There's people everywhere. Yeah, come on, let's go. Okay, right this way. Wait for me. Oh, people are so fast in the city. Well, welcome to our apartment. Whoa, this place is crazy. Look at the view. Oh my gosh, all the buildings are so tall here. Yeah, it's different than what it was like in the country, I bet. Way different. And your, your counters are purple. Everything looks so, like, crazy and unique. Yeah, follow me this way. Uh, we can go to my room. Uh, so this is my room. Oh, wow. I love it. It's so cool. Whoa, you have, like, video games? I've only seen these in the movies. You've never seen a game console before? Um, no. We'll have to go to the arcade sometime. Yes, please. Wait, and your TVs aren't in black and white? They're, like, actually in color? Uh, what? Your TVs weren't black and white? I mean, yeah, if we even had a TV. Well, most of the time, we use the radio. Wow, in your town, you must be really behind the times there. Yeah, and you're really ahead of the times. Yeah, it's really different. Yeah. Anyway, let's go to the bathroom. Okay. So, here's the bathroom. It's pretty plain and simple and all that. Wow, this bathroom is so nice. And look at the carpet. Wow, this is just amazing. Yeah, and then finally there's your room. Oh, I'm so nervous to see my room. Huh, let's go in. Oh my gosh. It's absolutely amazing. Yeah, I didn't know really like what you would like. So, um, you know, the journal company kind of just did whatever. This looks awesome. Yeah, so I hope you like yoga. I've never tried it before. What's over here? Oh, it's my own little couch. And look at this plant. It's so cute. Yeah, let's go check up there. Okay. Here's your bed, I guess. Whoa, the light over it is, like, literally so cool. Yeah, it is. And then here's your very own computer. Oh my gosh, I've never had one before. Whoa! This looks so cool. Yeah. Anyway, since it's getting late, maybe I should head to my room for bed and stuff. Yeah, I'll see you in the morning. Okay. Wow, this place is absolutely amazing. I can't believe I'm going to be living here for a while. Let me unpack some of my stuff. Here's my banjo. Oh, my stuffed animal, of course. I'll put that right here. And then I'll move this book by my nightstand. Here, I'll wear this to bed. Okay, there we go. Um, put this right here. And Mr. Teddy Bear on my bed. I guess it's time to go to sleep. The next day. Oh, I had a great sleep. Time to get ready for the day. Here's my headband. And, of course, my outfit. Okay. Good morning, sunshine. Good morning, sunshine. Oh, good morning. Uh, there's your breakfast. 
Oh, cool. Looks like some cereal. <gasps> this is amazing. Oh my goodness. And some milk. Hmm, reminds me of like back home. Okay. So, what are we doing today? Well, we're going to get you some new clothes. Because those ones that you have on now are not going to work in the city. Oh, really? Yeah, nobody wears overalls. Interesting. I thought everybody wore overalls. Well, not here they don't. Come on, let's go. Okay. Y'all, for some reason, my world is like rebuilding everything. So, um... Okay, here's the store that we should be shopping at. And one of the people that's supposed to dress you up and stuff should be here. Oh, cool. Hey guys, so, um, oh, so nice to meet you. I've never met anyone that's actually like Southern and from the country and stuff. But we're, we are going to be shopping at this super trendy school. Uh, what? We're going to be shopping at the super trendy shop called Owlette. So, um, yeah, nice to meet you. Hi, nice to meet you too, sugar bun. Oh my gosh, that is so cool that you speak country. Like, literally, I've never heard anyone speak country. Well, there's a first time for everything, I guess. Okay, now let's choose a new outfit. And this headband has to go. Like, it's gross. What? But that's my lucky bull riding headband. Uh, you bull ride? That's gross. Anyway, throwing it away. Oh, uh, anyway. Uh, okay, um. Anyway, uh, yeah, let's go inside and, like, look for some clothes, you know? Uh, okay. Hi, welcome into Owlette. So, over here we have our, uh, PJs, and then over here we have our super stylish clothes. So, just take whatever you want. Okay, so what I need you to do is go a try on on all those clothes. All of them? It's only three pieces of clothes. That's more than I've ever tried on in my whole entire life. I mean, other than overalls, obviously. Um, interesting. Actually, I don't think I've ever not worn overalls. You go to sleep in your overalls, too? You don't? Um, actually, I don't even own a pair of overalls. Uh, so, anyway, just go try on the clothes. Alright, I'll go try on this one first. Um, this one feels like a bit too much. Oh, just come out already. Yeah, I want to see what you look like. I don't think... This is my color. Oh my gosh, it looks so cute on you. Um, if you say so. Okay, go try on the next outfit. Okay. This one's actually pretty comfortable, but the pants, they're too crazy. Are you kidding me? They're so cute. Yeah, that like is adorable on you. Oh, well, thank you. Okay, go try on the final one. Okay. Wow, this one's like so comfy and it... It's pretty cute, I guess. Oh my gosh, all these clothes are to die for. Yeah, let's go ahead and take all of them. All of them? Well, I'll be wearing this one the most, because this is my favorite, because it's comfy. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Let's go look at the pajamas now. Okay, let's go over here. All right. So, here's some pajamas. Oh my gosh, this one is so cute. It blinds my eyes. It's so bright and crazy. No way. Well, how about this one? Look at all the cool shapes on it and stuff. So futuristic. Nuh-uh. No way. That does not look comfortable in my opinion. I mean, look how scratchy that silk looks. Uh-uh. Yeah, but it's cute. It doesn't have to be comfortable. How about that one? The... this one? You know what? It's better than nothing. And it's... you know, no one's gonna see your pajamas anyway. So yeah, you can get it. Better than overalls. Well, I wouldn't say that now, dear. Anyway, let's just go check out. Oh my gosh, all your outfits are so cute. Why, thank you. Okay, there you go. Okay, now let's go get your hair and makeup done. All right, let's go. Okay, here we are at the famous makeup like place. Oh wow, this place is nice. I don't think I've ever actually put any makeup on my face. Yeah, this place is nice. Hi, welcome to my makeup shop. Uh, you can put your clothes over here, and we'll do your hair and makeup. Oh, well, nice to meet you. Uh, my name. Yeah, yeah, whatever, sit in the chair. Uh, okay. As I was saying, my name is Susie. Yeah, I don't really care about your name, but, uh, my name is Emily. I guess I never introduced myself. Yeah, well, I'm Jessica, and I guess you knew that. 
cat and I'm cray cray say say. Cray cray say say. My real name is Sadie, but everybody calls me say say. Uh, cool. Anyway, we'll let you do, you know, your magic and stuff. Yes. Okay, first you need a bit of nail polish because your, your nails are so, like, bland and, like, gross. And is that dirt in them? Oh, yeah, in my free time, I love working in the garden. Ugh, okay. Well, um, let's put some perfume because you stink, girl. Well, I took a shower last night. Uh, are you sure? Uh, yeah. Okay. Anyway, here's the makeup brush. So let's add some neutral eyeshadow and stuff and maybe some blush. Yes, you are eating queen, but I'm not eating anything right now. I'm just sitting here. Ugh, never mind. You don't get the slang. What's a slang? Like a slang shot? Oh my goodness. Whenever I was just a little kid, you know, uh, I don't care. I, I'm not talking about slingshot. I'm talking about like slang, like words people say nowadays. Uh, okay. Yeah. Okay. So, let's put some just lipstick on you so you look pretty. And then, let's do your hair because I think you have some real potential. Oh, my goodness. You look gorgeous. What? Wow, I really do. I did the best I could, and I think it's pretty good for what I had to work with. Uh, excuse me. Okay, ladies, come in. Oh, my gosh. You look so good, Susie. Thank you. Yeah, you do look good. Now, try, time to try on the outfits we got for you. Okay. Okay, ready? Yeah, we're ready. Yep. Ready. Three, two, one. Here I am. You look so good, Susie. Yeah, you look amazing. You look like a real city girl now. Just a bit more perfume so you don't stink. Excuse me. Whatever. I might have one more thing that can help you look absolutely fabulous. I wonder what it could be. Yeah, me too. Here is some glasses, and they look amazing on you. Oh, I do love them. Thank you. Yeah, no problem. Now you look like a city girl, but you need to learn how to act like one. We'll do that tomorrow. Bye, guys. Thank you so much for your help. Bye. Bye, Susie. The next day. Okay, you look the part, but can you act the part? Well, I don't know. We should probably give it a try. Oh my goodness, look at all those like big buildings in the background. Yeah, so that's the first part of being a city girl. You're not supposed to act surprised about all the big buildings because they're just normal to you. But they're not. I'm used to a small town. Well, you're a city girl now, so you're used to a big city now. This is too confusing for me. Come on, let's just go try to do some stuff. What? Now, is there any way you could lose the country accent? Are you kidding me? I can't lose the country accent. Yeah, you're right. Whatever. Ugh. Lose the country accent? I feel like they're completely changing who I am as a person. Remember, I have to do this for mom and for granny. Have you ever ordered food before? Well, I went to my uh, neighbor's house, um, which is basically the whole town, and uh, we ate gumbo there, and, like, sometimes we take some gumbo home, if that's what you mean. But, like, have you ever went to, like, a food place and ordered? Oh, of course I have. So there's this little, like, smoothie shop downtown area, and I get a smoothie there from every day. Uh, but that's it. So no real food? No. Okay, what you're going to go do is go up to that total stranger and, you know, ask them for a pizza. Wait, you want me to go talk to strangers? Yeah. Stranger danger, though. Don't worry. Ugh, nothing's gonna happen. I'm right here. Ugh, okay. Give me a pizza. Well, excuse me. First of all, what kind do you want? And second of all, how are you gonna be paying for this pizza? Uh, her? Because I don't got any money. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I'll take a cheese pizza. Uh, can I just have a baked potato with... Yeah. This is a pizza place. Well, you didn't tell me you wanted potatoes. Do you want to look somewhere else? No, it's okay. I'll try this city food. This is actually Italian food, not city food. Just give us the pizza, man. Okay, here you go. 
There's one and two. Now pay up. Okay, there you go. Wow, people in the city are not as nice as people in the town. That's not true. There's just a lot more people in the city. So, you know, there's more of a chance that they're going to be rude. It's not that there's more rude people in the city. Yeah, you're right. I probably shouldn't have said that. Sorry. It's okay. Open wide. No. Oh, interesting. <gasps> oh my goodness, it's a poppy mangrove. A poppy what now? It's, it's a plant. It's a kind of plant. I grow plants all the time. I garden a lot. And I love these kind of flowers. They're one of my favorites. Interesting. Yeah, but they give you really bad allergies, though. Oh, well, anyway, do you want to eat your pizza? Of course. I've never had <gasps> such an amazing piece of food before. Pizza is so good. Yeah, it is pretty good. It's like my favorite. Oh, it's a cafe. We have a bunch of cafes in the little town that I grow up in. Really? Yeah, but this is nothing like them. This seems very pink and flashy. In our town, they're cozy and dark. I've always wanted to go to one of those. You should come by my town one day. Then I'll have to. So, what's next to being a city girl? Well, you have to know how to deal with the big crowd of people. So, see all those people right there? Yeah? I need you to go, just like, go through them. What do you mean, go through them? Like, you know, get in between them and go to the other side. But that's too hard. I'll just wait for them to move. There's no time for that in the city. And the city, people just go, 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 go. There's no time for waiting. <sighs> Fine, I guess. Um, excuse me. I said excuse me. Uh, hey, lady. C could you, like, move out the way, please? Uh, no. <laughs> well, get out the way! <sighs> ah! Wow, she's a natural. Did I do it right? Maybe a little less aggressive, but that was basically right. <laughs> That's good. Am I a city girl now? Well, we have a few more things to work on, but for now, I think we're doing good. Yay. Can I go home now? You still have a while until you go home. But once we keep practicing, I'm not sure if you'll ever want to leave the city. I'm not sure if that's too <laughs> so true. I'm already getting homesick. Well, let's head back to the house now. Okay. Two months go by of her practicing and perfecting her city life, and she f basically finds it regular. Two months go by, two months go by, two months go by, oh, 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 two months go by, oh. Bum -ba -dum -ba -dum. Crazy that like two months ago, I was not good at using these cellular device things, but whatever. I am so excited to go home tomorrow. I miss my family and my friends so much. And it feels like instead of two years, instead of two months going by, it feels like two years have gone by. But it's okay. I'm just ready to go home. Anyway. Susie, I'm not ready for you to go home yet. Please don't leave. You have been the best roommate ever. Oh, I really haven't, but thank you so much. I have a gift for you before you leave tomorrow. Oh, what is it? Here, it's your lucky bull riding headband, I think it's called. Oh my goodness, you, you found it and kept it from all th this time? Yeah, I wanted to surprise you with it before you left forever. Oh, you know I'm going to be la back. I mean, after my time in the city, I have really enjoyed it. But as much as this like journalism experiment had tried to change me, nobody can really change my country girl heart i mean besides you can take the cut you can take the girl out of the country but you can never take the country out of the girl i'm gonna miss you so much one day and very soon i'm gonna come visit your little town and i'm so excited to go in one of those coffee shops of course i'm so excited for you to go too anyway i should probably start packing i'm so excited to see all my friends and family i can't believe she's leaving me at first i was a little hesitant but now I'm sad she's leaving. I guess it's time to pack up all my stuff, and I can't believe she found my lucky headband. But let's pack. Obviously my ukulele, Mr. Teddy Bear. And I can keep some of my old clothes, but I need to make room for my new ones. Because there's a little city girl in me. I'll put it in in a second. This book and my headband. All my clothes and my headband, they're all packed up now. All there's left to do is wait. It's starting to get dark already. <sighs> it's time to go to sleep and 
Go see my family in the morning. The next day. Okay, well, this is where we first met. Yeah, I remember it like it was yesterday, but it was two months ago. Well, there is one thing before you leave we have to do. What's that? Your photo. Go take it. I forgot about it. Okay, here we go. Surprise! Before and after. Oh my gosh, what are you doing here? We're both here. Emily, too. We're here to say goodbye, and we had so much fun. Well, goodbye. You better get going now. I'm so excited to see all the journalism about me. Me too, and we'll have to come visit your town. Yep, bye guys. Bye, bye, bye. Here I go. Finally back, but where is everybody? Nobody's in town. Surprise! Oh my gosh! Mom! Hey, honey. I'm so glad to see you. Me too. And your southern accent, definitely. It is not as strong now. Well, I did spend too much, two months in the city. You look so different. Bestie, you look so good. City girl suits you. It'll never take me away from the country, though. Honey, Granny. Hey, girl. <gasps> hey. What's up? Oh, my gosh. Hey. Everybody's here. I'm so glad to be home. I love the city, but there's no place like home. Thank you guys so much for watching today's video, guys. Um, Jesus loves you. Please like and subscribe and go watch more of my videos. Bye!